Okay, I'm Stephen Downs. There's a motorcycle coming up behind me just as I start my video, of course, because that's the way it always works. We'll just let him go by here. So, this video is the first in my series, which I'm calling Project Anticosti. And uh, the idea of Project Anticosti is that this summer I will be cycling the length of Anticosti Island. That's the plan. And this is months before the plan. This is, well, what, April 2nd? So just the end of winter, as you can see. No leaves on the trees or anything like that yet. Um, I got myself a new camera to record these. It's a Fuji Film XT200. It's a mirrorless camera. Um, first time I've tried using Fuji Film, but I liked the reviews, so I'm going with it. This is a test. If it doesn't work, well, I'll use a different camera, but I'm pretty sure this will work. This addresses a lot of my needs. Now we're getting more ATV traffic here behind me. Uh, this time we got a four-wheeler, so I don't know. This is usually a pretty empty stretch of road, but of course as soon as I start recording video, it's Grand Central Station. And they're all going to have pause to have a look at me and see what I'm doing. So anyhow, Anticosti Island is in the Gulf of St. Lawrence. It's pretty far north. It's a lot more north than you might think. It's not that warm. But it should be nice in August, which is when I'm going. Has a population in winter of about 150. And in summer, maybe twice that. And maybe double that again with tourists. But it's about the size and shape of Jamaica. So it's big. There's basically no people. There's no cell phones. Once I'm out there, there won't be power. Now that's going to be a bit of a trick for me. You can't tell, but uh, in four days I'll be 63. Right now I weigh 329 pounds. I'm exactly not the person who should be doing an adventure ride like this, but I am. Because I've been riding bicycles all my life. I went backpacking last year with this bike. And here we can see it. This is my uh, Kona splice bike. You can see the, the uh, handlebar bag that I used. So this is the bike that I'll be using on Anticosti Island. Uh, I thought about getting bigger tires, but you know, we're mixing both distance and durability. So this is what I went for. Um, You'll notice the, uh, the seat bag isn't set up properly. Uh, that's because uh, I took the bike into the shop the other day and uh, had some work done on it. I put on the new tires um, and most importantly put a razor or riser on the handlebar there and then these extensions that will give me a better grip. But I think they moved the seat on me as well because I complained about leaning into the handlebars. So, and that meant that I can't hook up my bag properly at the moment, but I'll fix that. Uh, just as I'll fix everything for this. So anyhow, this today is the camera test. And uh, we'll see how this video goes, see how much power it took. All of those things we'll be testing. Um, and uh, this is the beginning. I'm out on a test ride here in rural Ontario. That's what it looks like. Um, and uh, I'll be doing some other test rides. I'll bring all of that to you on this, uh, on this channel or this playlist, whatever I decide to do. Uh, all leading up to the uh, the video from Anticosti Island. Obviously, I won't be doing a live stream from Anticosti because yeah, no internet. 
but uh, I'll be bringing you, you know, the full video. So that's it for now. Um, hope you enjoy. Well, I hope you enjoy as much as I'm going to enjoy doing it, but if you don't, well, yeah, whatever. <laughs> this is for me. This is my adventure, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to enjoy it. So, talk to you again.